Hi, Amy Fashion Toppings here with a shopping haul. Um, there's a little bit of everything. I have an estate sale, I have consignment shops, and I have Diva Diva Boutiques. So, Okay, now the first thing I got, I got it at an estate sale, and it's a matching set, and I'm so excited about it. I got, this is the uh, can, um, Burberry Candy Pink Coated Canvas Mini Satchel. But it is so cute and it's so tiny. But with it, I got a matching <laughs> sun hat. So, and I checked it for the authenticity. The Burberry has the U shaped the way it's supposed to, the R is shaped the way it's supposed to, and it has the um, the uh, little code behind the tag on the inside. I've been using this already. I used it the day I got it. I absolutely love it. And I've got papers and stuff in there. But behind the tag, there's the Burberry on there, Burberry London, and then behind the tag, it has the stamped numbers. So, but I got this bag and this cute summer hat, which I'll be wearing by the pool. Um, these two at the estate sale for $56 for the set, and I thought that was gr a great deal. They had, um, a lady had an entire collection. She had Fendi, she had Coach, and she had Prada, and, um... It was all, and they were the larger bags, and the prices were ridiculous. And so I was excited to have gotten these two for $56. <laughs> so, next, on to, I'll do my two consignment shops. I guess there's one Charm and Charlie's in here. I forgot to show this before. This um, little leopard scarf, it's, it's all wrapped up at the top, so it stays together. So it's kind of like two scarves in one. It was actually originally priced at $15, my lady's not going to let me show it, $15, and they had it on clearance for $4.99. And my mom and my aunt were in town, all three of us got the same scarf. But So it's just a simple little thin scarf. And that was from Charming Charlie's. And the tag says Charming Charlie's, and like I said, it was only $4.99. And this is le leopard scarf. I love it because it's like two scarves in one. So really cute. Okay, for the consignment shop. Okay, now this, I I just love having white shirts. You can't have too many white shirts. And so I got this white shirt at a store called Hut 8, and I have shown clothes from Hut 8 before. That's one of those places that they buy your clothes from you, and they, you know, they, of course they sell, and it has to be all name brand clothes. Now this is a company called Decree, and I paid $7 for it, and I was very happy to pay $7 for it, but isn't this soft white chiffon oh my gosh I'm in love it's an extra large it's nice big and baggy can you just see this you know wearing this over pretty much anything and it's gonna be so feminine oh I just absolutely love it and once again it was only seven dollars look at the back it's just it's just so girly so feminine and it's all chiffon oh I love it so I got that at hut eight now this next one I got at a consignment shop called uh, cons uh, Des Couture Consigner. That's what it's called, Couture Consigner. I can't remember the name of it. I've never been there before. And um, they had a 70% off sign out in the front. And so I actually got this shirt for $3.50. And it's, it's starched. You can feel that they just dry cleaned it and it's been starched. So it's just like a peasant top. It's white. And it's meant to be left untucked because it's got the little pleats all along here with a little area in the front. I don't know what they call those plackets, or I can't remember what they call those, but it looks like a tuxedo shirt because it's got a couple pleats in the front. And it's kind of a warm material though. It's, it, like I said, it's like a men's starchy, it's like a men's starchy shirt, um, like a dress shirt, but it's a little bit thicker. And it's not gonna breathe much. So this will be definitely one of those, you know, with jeans in the evening when it's cooler out. So it's just, a Oops. So it's just a basic peasant type long sleeve shirt because it's meant to be left untucked or tunic or however you want to call it. So those two. Now on for Diva Diva. <laughs> Diva Diva was closed for like two weeks and um, they had a big sidewalk sale yesterday and so I had to go. They had a lot of stuff that was 50% off, which I got a couple things that were 50% off, but the rest of the stuff I got was 20% um, off. 
I love everything I got. I actually had to sit there and go through my basket and decide what I could put back and, and be without because I had so much and I have so many clothes already and so I couldn't narrow it down. But let me let me go ahead and show you. The fir this this first th first item is definitely going to be a DIY refashion, and I'm going to try it. This is going to be my project, hopefully this weekend, um, because it's huge on me. But I love the fabric. It's a 3XL. I don't know if you can see that. It's a 3X. It's a 3X, and the brand is Kim uh, by Kim Rogers. Never heard of it, but the material is. Of course, let me see if it's anywhere in here, material. Yeah. It's 95% polyester, but 5% spandex. But I love, it feels like swimsuit material. A little bit, little bit of a sheen to it. But it's a 3X, and I am so excited to make this into something. It is just a color block dress. So I'm picturing it either becoming a strapless dress, so it's got the purple at the bottom, or making it into a halter dress because th this type of fabric is like look at stretchy it's like bathing suit bathing suit material basically but it it is it lays look at how it lays nice and it moves nice and so even though it's a 3x 3xl I'm gonna make it into something because look at it, it's got the red orange red and orange and then a beautiful purple at the bottom so I'm going to make this probably into a halter dress so that I can get some use out of it this summer because uh, I love this type of fabric. So I bought it for the fabric. Oh, and the price was, it was $10 and then um, $10 plus my 20% off. So I paid $8 for it. But, you know, I'd, it, I'll end up paying that much just buying the fabric if I can find this fabric in this colors. So basically, like I said, I bought that for the fabric. Okay, this next item uh, is a medium and it was eight dollars plus twenty percent off. So I don't know what is that six. <laughs> I'm not good at math. Um, and I wasn't quite sure about it when I, you know, I saw the fabric and I'm like, oh, leopard. But I tried this on and I love it. It is so comfortable. It is all baggy at the top and then it's got a cute little tiny flowy skirt at the bottom. When I first took it off the rack and held it up, I was like, oh, okay, what's, you know, it's, it's okay. Oh my God, I just fell in love with it. And it is so darn cute. But it's, so it's going to be tight at the bottom and the top part is kind of baggy. And also it is that, it's that fabric that has such great draping. You know, it just, it has nice body to it and it keeps its shape and it's just, I love this kind of fabric too. But this one, oh, so this one, like I said, I paid $8 and I had 20% off. Oh, and the brand was Madison Petite. It doesn't fit, feel petite when I tried it on, so never pay attention to sizes when you're thrifting. It says it's a petite, but it definitely does not fit by, like a petite. And with the weight that I gained, I usually would end up buying a large, and this is a medium, and it fits perfect. So. I scored. I'm so happy with that one. Now this next one is this, I'm picturing this with a white t-shirt and flip-flops on a really casual day. I actually at my son's graduation saw a woman sitting in front of me and I even leaned over to my mom and I said, her skirt's really cute. It's kind of casual. It's cute. I like it. And then I see it at Diva Divas. <laughs> so I wonder if this person wore it to graduation and then donated it. I don't know. But it was uh, $10 and then 20% off. So I paid $8 for it. But it's like a denim tie-dye, really comfy long skirt. It's the, so it comes down to the middle of my shins. But I love the, the, the dyeing of the fabric. It's not denim. This is a really gauzy, soft cotton. But they dyed it with all these streaks in it to make it look kind of like a denim. And then it's all, you know, frayed all over. I just think that is such a cute skirt. And I paid, like I said, $10 or $8 with the sale price. I didn't get a lot at the 50% off rack. I ended up jumping right into the full price 20% off rack. Okay. 
This next dress is just adorable and it's brand new. Um, let's see here. The brand, never heard, but heard of it. APNY. I'm not sure what it stands for, um, but it's brand new and it still has tags on it, but someone tore the price tag off, so I don't know how much it was originally. But look at how cute this is. It looks like a little candy striper dress. Green and white. Now, I do have to wear a bandeau or a sports bra underneath it, a white one, because this is, I mean, my, my girls fill this puppy out, and um, so it shows a lot of cleavage. So I will be wearing a bandeau or a sports bra underneath it. But isn't that cute? And it comes down, it's like T-length, I believe, right to the middle of my calves. And then the back, it crisscrosses and, and the it ties. So isn't that adorable? And if you don't want to wear a bra, you don't have to because it has the bra padding in it, which I'll probably take out um, because the amount of cleavage it shows, I will be wearing a bra no matter what underneath this thing. But just adorable. And the price on this was... So this is more expensive uh, because it was brand new and no one's ever worn it, so it's tags on it. It's $15 and then 20% off. And I can't do mental, mental math very well, but green and white striped, just adorable. This reminds me of a little candy striper, you know? Okay, this next one was on, no, this one, this next one was on the 50% off rack. Um, it was $8 and then 50% off, so it's $4. It's so, I love the colors. It's like a hunter green, and it has the, the salmon, a little bit of lighter green, and then the cream in it with all the circles on it. It's so cute. It, holding it up really doesn't do it justice, but it is so cute on. So comfortable, comfortable and it, um, it's got some pleats in the back. I will have to wear like um, volleyball shorts underneath in case the wind blows because <laughs> it's just at that length where, you know, anything can happen <laughs> if the wind blows. So I would definitely have to wear like little biker shorts or something underneath it or I'm going to, one of my sewing projects coming up is going to be uh, a slip and then putting lace along the bottom so that uh, it gives a little bit of detail and your slip can hang out and it's going to look really cute. So, but um, I just love the colors of this and I only paid $4 for it. So I actually love this. Now this one, holding it up will not do it justice. I mean, it is, it's so cute on. And it's uh, medium and it was $12 and um, $12 plus 20% off. It's so cute. So it reminds me of like um, Mary Ann from Gilligan's Island. <laughs> but it's just, and it's, um, it's a real stretchy fabric. And once again, great draping. I mean, it has, you know, nice body to the fabric. That's what I like. So look at this. It's got the little bow in the front. And it's got um, chiffon coming out the sleeves, a little beige chiffon. Like I said, the bow in the front. And then the whole bottom. Look, it's got a chiffon beige ruffle at the bottom. I just think that is so cute. And it's a perfect length. See it right above my knees. So I was real excited about that. And the price, like I said, was 12, uh, it's a medium $12 plus 20% off. Okay. Now this next item is, <laughs> it's a brand new pair. Tags are still on it. Buttons are still on it. Brand new pair of, um, chinos from j crew and they're size 14 so they're too big but um they were 50 percent off and so i got these for four dollars and they're just basic chinos but they're brand new and they're from j crew so i'm gonna make these fit i'm gonna just take them in at the waist just a little bit you know so they fit around my waist and then leave them a little bit baggier and fuller through the legs and cut the length off so that I'm gonna turn them into, um, you know, longer capris, you know, with the cuff at the bottom. So make them look like they're meant to be big, but make them fit. <laughs> so I'm gonna just tighten them up around the waist a little bit to get rid of all the gaps and uh, wear them a little bit baggy and wear them a little bit low. And kind of like the boyfriend style that I talk about all the time that I'm obsessed with. Um, I'm gonna to try to make them that. For four bucks, they're brand new 
And I mean, they still have the buttons and the tags. No price on them, so it must have been a return. But, um, you know, the tags and the buttons are still on. But four bucks, brand new. So I'm excited about that. Okay, this last item. I was on the fence. I wasn't sure if I wanted it. Uh, the brand is Sharon, Sharon Anthony Lifestyles Dress. Now, so I got it inside out. I wasn't sure if I if I wanted this or not, and I was on the fence. But the fact that I kept on re going back to it and trying it on again, and then Cindy, you know, she's one of my favorite girls. Um, she was working, and uh, and, she, and and she, you know, everybody was saying if you put it on that many times and you're thinking about it that much, <laughs> you may as well get it. So I got it. It's more than I would have spent normally, fifteen dollars, and then twenty percent off. But I just thought there's. You know, what I was thinking is I'm going to make a slip dress. Just a nice out of lining fabric or something. A nice little slip dress and do it in a couple different colors and wear this over them. I have a black slip dress I could use, but it's all like crocheted. See, look at it's all crocheted. And I just couldn't pass it up. I mean, it's a unique fabric. And so I just couldn't walk away from having this unique fabric. And it's all see-through, but I mean, I can see this, you know, making a pink satin um, slip dress underneath uh, and maybe a bright turquoise or just, you know, several different colors and then just wear this over them and the outfit will look different all the time with a different color slip underneath or even a gold, gold satin, you know, like a lining. So many possibilities and I just, I mean, I couldn't pass up that. I mean, that fabric is just so unique. So I was really excited about that. So I got a lot of fun stuff. I'm thinking I covered everything. So I'm going to go ahead and take pictures of these and put pictures at the end. And I'm going to be trying to get you some videos out. I do have summer guests coming to stay with me starting on Monday. They're going to be here all summer. And they're going to be staying in my sewing room. All the stuff is getting moved and a bed's being put in here. So I won't be able to do any sewing. So I'm going to try to do my projects this weekend before they get here. And then I'm going to take my sewing machine in and get it maintenance and cleaned since I can't, I'm not going to be able to use it anyway since someone's going to be sleeping in here. Um, it's a good time for me to do all the maintenance on my sewing machine. So I'm going to take it in and have it cleaned and timed and all that good stuff. Just routine maintenance while I'm doing that. Okay, well I've rambled on enough. Well, this is Amy with Fashion Toppings. Until next time, you have a great day.